Hey, what's up guys? This is Wasi from FlamelineVisualEffects.com and welcome back to my another brand new After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you how to create this. This video is sponsored by ProductionGrid.com Whether it's music, graphics or visual effects, Production Crate has you covered. We've begun a revolution in the way half a million creators like you produce content, becoming the source of all your production-ready assets at an affordable price. Thousands of professionally built video assets, sound elements and tools are at your disposal helping you save time, perfect your projects, and earn the recognition you deserve. Sign up today and make it awesome! Can I get 500 likes for this tutorial? If yes, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so first create a new composition. Let's call it uh, logo animation and I am going with 1920 1080p frame rate 29.97 and duration make it 6 seconds long then click on ok. Ok let's import our logo you can also use text instead of logo. Now select this logo and drag it into project window and then select this logo and place it into this timeline then press S and make it little bit smaller like this then uh, right click on this layer then choose pre-compose and select move all attributes and then rename it to logo then click on ok now select this logo and press ctrl D twice then hide the top layer then select the second layer and then go to effect and preset window and search for fill then select this effect and apply onto this layer then color set it black then again go to effect and preset window and search for matte choker then select this effect and apply onto this layer then uh, geometric softness set it 2 and iteration set it 2 perfect now select this 2 layer and then right click and then choose pre-compose and then select mobile attributes and rename it to border then click on ok now hide this layer and then turn on visibility of this layer ok let's go to project window and import our project files you can download these project files from productioncreate.com link in the description box below Ok now select this reflection map layer and then place it below the logo layer then press S and make it smaller like this. Then go to effect and preset window and then search for motion tile. Then select this effect and apply onto this layer. Ok now increase the output width and also increase the output height then click on uh, mirror edges perfect ok now uh, go to beginning of this animation and then set a keyframe on title center then go to end of this animation and then increase the x amount little bit like this Ok now select this layer then right click and choose pre-compose and then select move all attributes and rename it to reflection map. Then click on ok. Now change this layer track mat to alpha mat. Perfect. Ok now select this layer and then go to effect and preset window and search for CC glass. Then select this effect and apply onto this layer then go to surface and then bump maps 
set it border and then softness set it 30 height set it minus 30 and displacement set it minus 500 then go to light and then light type set it point light then again go to effect and preset window and search for cc uh, blobby lies then select this effect and apply onto this layer then go to blobbiness and blob layer set it border and property set it alpha and then uh, softness set it 6 and cut away set it 3 looks good to me then go to light and then light type set it point light perfect okay now go to effect and preset window and search for uh, curves then select this effect and apply onto this layer and then change the rgb curves to something like this perfect ok now select all layers then right click and then choose pre-compose and rename it to metal logo then click on ok then go to beginning of this animation then press ace to open scale then set a keyframe on it then go to end of this animation and increase the scale amount to 110 or maybe 115 perfect okay now go to project window and then select this lightning footage and drag it into this composition okay now select this layer and then press s and make it smaller little bit and then adjust the position okay let's ramp preview it looks good to me Okay now go to project window and then select this fireball footage and then place it into this composition and then move it forward few seconds something like this and then adjust the position and make sure the fireball fully cover your logo then select this layer and then press T to open opacity then set a keyframe on opacity then go backward few frames then opacity set it 0 looks good to me ok let's create a new composition by clicking here and let's call it main and then click on ok ok now go to project window and select this floor layer and place it into this composition then right click and choose pre-compose and then select mobile attributes and rename it to floor then click on ok now hide this layer ok now select this logo animation comp and drag it into this composition ok now select this layer and press ctrl plus d then select the second layer then right click then transform and then click on flip vertical then drag it below something like this ok now create a new adjustment layer so right click new and click on adjustment layer then put it below the logo animation layer 
and then go to effect and preset window and search for compound blur then select this effect and apply onto this adjustment layer then blur layer set it our floor and then maximum blur set it 100 Now we can see a nice reflection, perfect. Okay now create another adjustment layer, so right click new and click on adjustment layer. Then go to effect and preset window and then search for sharpen. Then select this effect and apply onto this layer and then sharpen amount set it 20. Then again go to effect and preset window and search for noise. Then select this effect and apply onto this layer and then noise amount set it uh, 5. Perfect. Our animation is complete. Press 0 to ramp preview this. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Have a great day.